about under finance that was project number one i'm talking about rune that is project number two and i'm talking about ftm that was project number three so out of the three the best performer in the last 24 hours is rune right now look if you look at the chart of rune and you look at the monthly time frame like even after this massive move right here chat i'm telling you right now this is one of the most bullish charts out there i'm looking at the monthly not the four hour not the one hour this is the monthly and what that means is over the next many months as long as the monthly time frame continues to look this good price of loan should continue to go up you know these are the charts that we die for these last six months right these are the setups that we were asking from this market so finally right finally we have something that's exciting so i'm looking at rune right now there is going to be pullbacks of course nothing goes up in a straight line you know rune is going to go to six dollars it is going to pull back to five uh, to five dollar fifty cents it is going to go to ten dollars it is going to pull back to eight dollars that is going to happen that is part of the process but as long as you stay with the monthly time frame this is the project that is going way way up and i'm telling you right now we're looking at the old time high guys 22 dollars is finally coming in 2025 22 dollars is definitely coming all right because of how this monthly time frame is looking so if you go to the weekly i mean i was looking at this thing yesterday and i share with you guys the similarities between what was happening and the chart of TAO, you know, if you guys remember, TAO is, you know, one of the top performer in the last two weeks. All right. But if you look at the chart of TAO, and I should be able to pull it up right here. All right. Before this big move to $600, TAO was right here, guys, in the $360 range. And when TAO, was in the $360 range. This was a project that was ready for prime time. So if you look at Rune, Rune was looking, look, exactly, I don't want to say identical, but exactly the same, guys. So I'm on this weekly time frame right here. And I don't think we get a weekly pullback or some sort of a bigger pullback until. We at least get to seven dollars and sixty cents. So if you were to ask me, even at the current price, I think this is a great time to get in. But those that got in yesterday, all right, when I when I was analyzing this and I was, you know, begging you guys that this is the right time to get in and don't wait for a pullback, you know, that position is already up. And that was a much, you know, a much more you know juicy entry because you know we got in right up you know right before this breakout but even at the current price you know 562 look maybe the market gives you a pullback uh, who knows there's always pullbacks but uh we go into seven dollars and sixty uh seven dollar thirty six cents basically in the seven thirties guys and you're looking at a thirty percent move you know going from the current price a ruin is not the only one I'm looking at FTM. Look, I want you guys to take a look at the setup of FTM. This is FTM on the monthly. Talking about a project that is about to massively pump, you know, over these next, I don't know how many months. I just know over the next many, you know, over the next months, price is going up and we're more likely to retest the previous all time high. So I'm looking at FTM right now on the monthly. This is the greatest time to get in. Now, yesterday, you know, I gave a much, much more better entry in the 60 cents range. 
but we haven't seen anything. And even at 72 cents, I think this is a good time to get in. Right? The reason is because, look, whether you got in at 60 cents or 72 cents, you know, does it really matter? Absolutely not, guys. And the reason is because you're not investing in FTM to take profits at 72 cents. No, you are getting in and you, you, know, you want to take profits, hopefully around $2, hopefully around $3, 4 5 probably $10. Uh, that is the approach that you want to have to this market right now, all right? You want to have a long-term approach. Can we think, you know, three to eight months from now, where is the price of, you know, FTM in many of these projects is going to be? Where? Are we more likely going to be below a dollar or are we more likely going to be above a dollar? So FTM looks incredible on the monthly and then when you look at the weekly oh my god all right we're going all the way up to 97 cents all right i do not see some sort of a major pullback until at least ftm is around 97 cents all right you look you look at this weekly macd right here <laughs> doesn't get any more bullish than this right here guys all right it does not get any more bullish than this right here. And I've always talked about, you know, if you want to make a lot of money from the market, you want to get in when your indicators are starting to turn bullish, you know, early on in the trend. You don't want to get in when your MACD is all the way up here and the price is all the way at these levels. So FTM, you know, we are pushing to 97 cents. That is where we're going and potentially to retest the highs of 2024, guys. So very exciting times, you know, definitely very exciting times. And if you don't have a position, yeah, you definitely might want to reconsider. So those are the three projects. And of course, you know, the last one that I shared with you guys yesterday was Ondo Finance. Ondo is up 5%. This is Ondo on the weekly. All right. Ondo is, is definitely going to a dollar six cents. This is where Ondo is going, guys. A dollar six cents. That is where this project is heading. Chas, give me a second. So the whole market just looks extremely bullish, right? The whole market, guys, just looks extremely bullish. And then, of course, you know, we talked about Jasmine. I'm telling you guys right now, this is the best time to get in. If you love Jasmine, and if you love making money, you know, if you want to make money from this market, this is the greatest time to get in. We are going to see a huge breakout pretty soon right here, guys. Look, whether it's today, tomorrow, the day after, a, a week from now, we are going to get a breakout. And I say, either you get in right now or you're going to chase. You are going to chase after the price chat you know once jasmine clears